Unfortunately, I can't show you the oil too much right below the surface tonight because uh, of the, the fact that the tides weigh in. I can, however, show you the dispersant that's washing up that they have been obviously, quite obviously, feverishly spraying for the last few days. Fog's rolling in. I can hear the boats coming in and out. Can't see them because of the fog. I want you to see the amount of dispersant laying and washing in on the water. Here we are, folks. Your daily fix of Corexit. And it's all along the shore. The entire shoreline with this milky Corexit coming in. This is Denise, Long Beach, December 30th. I'm going to have to sign out for today. God bless us, everyone. Look how nice. They've got a TV, an outdoor TV in the side of this motorhome. And these people over here with their little girl. I think the city, though, just came up and told them, uh, or is harassing them and telling them they can't stay here. They can't park here. Wouldn't you know? they're giving them a bad time. No overnight parking. Yep, they're having to pick up their uh, fire pits and put everything away, I guess, and pad up and go somewhere else. How pathetic. Nobody's welcome on the coast anymore. disgusting. Well, happy to see, I'm sorry, I'm happy to see that the uh, street is reopened. We had a gas leak and a sewer leak and everything else. They're still trying to get things right from Hurricane Katrina. This will soon be a little restaurant that is part of the um, landscape has been here. Um, uh, the street's torn up. This is the main drag. This is Jefferson Davis Avenue, Long Beach, Mississippi. Um, this is the former site of Harper McCon Elementary School. Um, and now we have coming soon a town square, I guess, where they're going to have like uh, a little park. Town, they call it the town green. Um, here is the Long Beach Library, which was spared, uh, well, for the most part. It was ransacked, of course, by the storm. Here is a new restaurant, now open, called Bulls. I believe that's a steakhouse. Have to try that one out one day when I can afford it. And this over here used to be our senior citizen center and across from it is the brand new city hall which has just been occupied I think this this week here's a very old Hancock Bank building which is now a coffee shop Little Ray Seafood which is not doing much business I can attest to that but surely getting a few things back since Hurricane Katrina. Over there is a historic home that they have no funding to fix, but I'm hoping to see that that's done someday soon. This is Denise. We're in Long Beach, Mississippi been down at the beach. I wanted to take some samples, but tide was way up, um, so I couldn't uh, couldn't really adequately do it, and it was very, very foggy. 
Um, I've got all the supplies here in the van. Um, and as soon as I'm able and the weather permits, I'm going to get some samples. Um, this is Denise signing off for the day, December 30th. One of the, uh, well, only a few days left of 2010. Tomorrow is New Year's Eve. And we'll ring in a hopefully better and brighter new year. Um, that's all for now. Thank you.